This is Mike with AskTractorMike.com. I'm in Dyersville, Iowa today, and this is going to sound a little bit like a commercial for the Dyersville Chamber of Commerce, but if you're into tractors, and especially if you're into toy tractors, this is the Mecca. First week of November, the National Farm Toy Tractor Show. Let's take a tour. Well, you may be wondering why the National Farm Toy Show is located in Dyersville, Iowa. And if you wonder where Dyersville is, if you go just due west of the Illinois-Wisconsin border, about 30 miles, you'd be to Dyersville. And the reason there's lots and lots of farm toys around Dyersville, Iowa, is most of us that are tractor people that own a few toys back in the closet, most of them came from Dyersville. And that's because a guy named Fred Ertl, E-R-T-L, Sr., back in 1959 started building farm toys in this little town of around 4,000 now uh, in, in eastern Iowa. It's a beautiful part of the country, but uh, he started building toys here and there's been several companies spin off uh, from family members and former employees, but they all kind of build uh, farm toy type stuff and and once a year they open the uh, area to a farm toy show and it's huge and there's farm toys for sale in pavilions and at parks and at, at places where they manufacture toys and, and the main hub of the whole thing is at the National Farm Toy Museum and that's what I'm going to kind of talk about today if you're kind of a tractor person and you enjoy seeing toys um, and you're ever in that area uh, it's worth the trip to Dyersville to see the National Farm Toy Tractor Museum and it's open during the show uh, there's lots and lots and lots of toys in there encased in, in, in glass for you to look at. There's classic tractors. Uh, there's a few trucks and things like that. There's industrial type equipment. There's a few foreign tractors around. Lots of implements. Kind of you know, oddball farming type stuff that's maybe not a tractor. I think my favorite one in there is a 1 8 scale John Deere 70. And if you know models, they, the, the uh, fraction that's next to them is the percentage that they are the real thing. Uh, 1 16th is, is the biggest I've ever owned, and this is a 1 8 size. So it's huge. It's as big as your footstool. But I had a fun day walking around this event it's i think every year in november it's usually after a harvest but this year they had a lot of water so the farmers are going hot and heavy around dyersville trying to get the corn picked and and that was itself a a pretty amazing thing to watch but uh, the toy show is is right in the middle of dyersville and you can walk around for the better part of the day and see every kind of toy you can imagine i think my my favorite part of the of the farm toy show uh, I've always been looking for a DeWalt football and lo and behold there it is just like my DeWalt drill that I love so well a DeWalt football while you're in Dyersville you need to go out to the Field of Dreams and the Field of Dreams I don't know whether you remember a few years ago they had a baseball movie with Kevin Costner called the Field of Dreams and this guy started hearing voices telling him to build a a, a baseball diamond and it had the the quote if you build it he will come and go the distance and he started seeing ghost baseball players that would disappear when they walked into the corn. I can kind of relate to that a little bit about starting a YouTube channel. If you make tractor videos, they will watch. I survive on web traffic. I'd be honored if you'd subscribe to my YouTube channel and like my Facebook page and share this video with other tractor enthusiasts. If you have questions or comments, put them down below. We'll try to get back with you. Thanks for watching.